Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel Lockyer Learning. In this video, we are going to solve ICSE Mathematics Class 8 Chapter 1 Rational Numbers Exercise 1D Question Number uh, 8. It is what? Find 1, 6, 2, 60, 3, 600 rational numbers between minus 5 by 8 and 3 by 8. Now, here we have to do a little uh, thinking. Basically, we have to find 6, 60 and 600 rational numbers see how we will find that first we'll find the six rational numbers between these two numbers right we have to find separately so six first then 60 then 600 now see here we'll have minus 5 by 8 and 3 by 8 these are the numbers what we will do it is already having 8 in the denominator you can easily see between minus 5 by 8 and minus 3 by 8 uh, plus 3 by 8 what do we get minus 4 by 8 minus 3 by 8 minus 2 by 8 minus 1 by 8 0 1 by 8 and so on so we'll start not from minus 5 by 8 but from the number right after it that is minus 4 by 8 the number that is to the right of it on the number line or simply plus 1 on it minus 4 by 8 first number then what minus 3 by 8 then minus 2 by 8 and then minus 1 by 8 then 0 and then 1 by 8 right how many 1 2 3 4 5 6 right six numbers we found you can also take numbers after 1 by 8 that is 2 by 8 3 by 8 4 by 8 it is not wrong right you can take that but the thing is if you will increase here then you have to decrease one number here if you will increase one number here then you will have to decrease one number here why because we want only six numbers keep that in mind now next will be what 60 rational numbers right we will find 60 rational numbers now between these two how see like i said previously we multiplied by 10 First, we multiplied by the LCM of the denominators, then we multiplied by 10 according to our needs. Same thing we will do here. I will multiply minus 5 by 8 by 10 because we want equivalent rational numbers. So, into 10 minus 50 upon 80. All right. And then next one is 3 by 8. So, I'll have 3 by 8. So, 8 into 10, 3 into 10, 30 by 8. 80 fine now see here now i'm going to insert 60 rational numbers between minus 50 upon 80 and minus 30 upon 80 right there is nothing much to do it's very easy now that we have 80 80 here we can easily calculate 60 right see here it was 8 so we were only able to calculate maximum 8 or 10 right uh, not more than that like I'm just uh, seeing minus 5 and 8, right? 3, so 5 and 3, right? So you'd only be able to calculate 8 rational numbers if denominators were 8. Now we have changed them to 80. We can calculate how many? Minus 50 minus and then plus 30. This is not minus 30, this is plus 30. So how many? 80 rational numbers now, right? And how many do we want? 60. So see, I'll begin from minus 49. Okay, so I'll begin from minus 49 minus 49 upon 80 then we will have minus uh, 48 right minus 48 upon 80 and this will keep on going on and on and on now i will come to a stage when i will have what minus 1 by 80 and then 0 again you have to keep a track of how many numbers you have found because if one number is less or one number is more then entire thing becomes wrong okay uh, try to give 60 only right not more than it nor less than that see till 0 how many do we have minus 49 here till my uh, minus 80 right see minus 49 and minus 1 between them how many numbers are there add them as well so 49 are rational numbers right 49 from negative because minus 40 into minus 1 then 0 is also there one more so 49 plus 1 so 50 we have already got from negative and positive this i am going to simplify it because you might be confused get confused when how many numbers do we want now we want 60 so 50 we have already got we want 10 more 
10 more means we will go plus 10 in 0 so 1 by 80 2 by 80 right dot 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 we'll have 9 by 80 and then is less than 10 by 80 finally we have got 10 by 80 here so, right so basically 10 more we needed from 0 so we have gone 1 by 2 uh, 1 by 80 2 by 80 and so on till 10 by 80 and here already we had 50 so we have got 60 rational numbers in total now 600 numbers right the uh, the biggest one that is your 600 now this is also going to be very easy what we will do is now we will multiply by 100 if we would have wanted used 10 here again by multiplying by 10 we will have 80 and with 80 in the denominator we can only get how many maximum 80 rational numbers how many do we need 600 so we have to increase our rational numbers so rather than 10 we will go with 100 as the uh, multiplier this time for our rational numbers now make the equivalent rational numbers minus 5 by 8 8 into 100 5 into 100 minus 500 upon 800 same ways here 3 by 8 8 into 100 3 into 100 so 300 upon 800 now go here between minus 500 upon 800 and 300 upon 800 now again it has become very easy for us why because we can calculate how many rational numbers now 800 and how many do we need 600 again go from minus 499 not 500 but 499 499 upon 800 okay we'll start from this then again we will have minus 480 sorry for not 480 but 498 right so 498 upon 800 and so on we will go keep on going we'll get minus 1 by 800 and then 0 minus 499 to minus 1 is 499 rational numbers see don't be confused if you have to calculate the number of negative rational numbers you have just see the starting number don't go till the end just see the starting number 499 remove the minus sign 499 that means i have got 499 rational numbers from these negative ones now come to the positive and zero zero will always be there so plus one so 499 plus one 500 rational numbers we've already got and how many do we want 100 more because 600 is the total right so we will go 1 by 800 dot 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 at the end i'm not able to get some space so we'll have 100 upon 800 simply just like that why because we needed 100 rational numbers more so we have gone to uh, gone till 100 right that is what 600 rational numbers this way you can do and of course it's a very common reason why i'm putting these dots in between because we cannot write 60 or 600 rational numbers in one go so just to make it clear we're just putting dots that the numbers are there between them right and friends this is all for today if you are new to my youtube channel do not forget to subscribe and leave a like on this one till then take good care of yourselves and